Good morning everyone. Looks like it's going to be nice and dry today. Time for me to go and jump on the TM. I don't know if you can hear all the birds. They're singing to us this morning. <laughs> they must love it in this shed. So yeah, I'll jump on the TM and we'll get a bit of feeding done. I do love the lights on this thing. Oh, oh, wrong ones. There we go. Look at that. Jeez, that'd blind some people. We've got the everyday stuff to do. And we're going to be taking, we've got an old fence um, in the grass field that's not used for ages. It's just like barbed wire. Um, it's a mess, basically. So I'm going to take all barbed wire down today. And then probably in a few months when ground gets drier we'll pull all the posts out um, and make it back into one big field again right. I'll try and show you that a bit later see that in the middle of the uh, screen there Em thought that was a cat yesterday <laughs> I think it's a, piece, it's a piece of muck or something a, a flap of muck or uh, a piece of wood she's like Joe I think there's a cat there's a cat at the end of that trough did make me smile I'm like what are you on about Em in the end of that trough, is it, is it a dog? No, it's a dog, it's a dog. Why? It's not a cat or a dog, it's a piece of muggy in here. Uh, oh, God. She brings some humour to the place, does she? I've never seen that before. Cows have managed to flip the ring feeder up. Have you done that? I've never had them do that before. Well, for me to uh, lift that up on its end, well, it's not really, but I've got arms and legs. All right. I know cows have got arms and legs, but um, they can't use them the way I can. Yeah, I've never, never, never seen that before. I don't know if your cows do it. If they do, let me know. Oh, that's a new one for me. Something new every day here. Yeah. Andy's about blowing some straw in. Em's just getting out of shop. We'll put some straw on that outside there with the uh, spread of bale and freshen that up in a minute. I just told him about your cat and your dog that you saw yesterday. But I saw it. Didn't <laughs> Need the glasses back on, I think. Oh, okay. <laughs> I know, it was funny that. He made me chuckle last night. I do you only thought it was a cat. <laughs> I know you did. <laughs> I wish I'd recorded it, it would really have. I'm just putting some fodder beat round. These guys absolutely love it. It's their favourite bit of what we feed them, I think. Um, so yeah, we'll uh, just keep blasting this out. It's quite hard to do while driving one hand. Get by. Andy's got to put a bit of straw in that left hand side still. He's strawed up this side, but this side's looking a bit. I'm not saying it's looking bad, but it's looking a bit yellow. Oh, he'll get that sorted in a minute. And we'll get this spreader bale on next, I think. A couple of pens to do with that. Keep him busy again. You're getting professional like that, Em, aren't you? Professional. Professional. We've got some fair dusty straw this morning. Uh, I was just going to say, Em doesn't always uh, just put pipes on. It's just really easy for me to film when, uh, when she's doing it, because I'm not actually doing anything. <laughs> she just said, if any hope goes wrong in her life, she knows she, she's going to be professional at putting pipes on and opening gears. Way she said it, it wasn't quite funny. <laughs> so yeah, cows are enjoying themselves, having a bit of a straw party this morning again. Um, yeah, look at them. Tails wagging, throwing themselves about. Loving it. Yeah, they are dusty, aren't they? Yeah, I, was, yeah. I was just saying, um, uh, you, don't, you don't always just put pipes on. She's been, she been driving JCB this morning. This is just a morning job, you see. I'll friend her. But, um, yeah, 
if uh, if it all goes wrong and we go out of business, um, he's a professional. Get bitch, fight bitch. <laughs> Uh, but we don't plan on doing that anytime soon, so, so she's not good. available, not available for work yet. So. Well, not yet. Right, so yeah, just going to blast some in this outside yard now. And um, just make it look fresh out here. They look all happy in there, nice and laid down. That brown one is still laid down. I think Andy put a bit of straw there earlier. They were going to just share one bale into here, but better if we just get to it. It is. So yeah, that's a that's a spreader bale working. You see, it chucks it about. I don't know. What will it be? Thirty foot, something like that. Twenty foot. Um. It was a fairly decent job, just not as controlled as the uh, Teagle, you can't just put it exactly where you want it, but, but yeah, right. I think it's about time I went to Meta Coffee after this, coffee time, most important time of day, apart from dinner time, tea time, we found an oil leak on his brand new machine. Well, this one went to him. Put auxiliary line, pissing oil out. So we'll have a look, see if we can, I'm guessing it's just not been tightened up right. But uh, yeah, see that, slack as piss. So, hopefully I am, not took it too tight, but I think that should be, should be jo job I done. I up to come and fix that, didn't I? That'd have been funny. But yeah, yeah, it just needs tightening up, we're adjustable. <laughs> Tea boys here, look. Sorting job out. All the coffees now. It's time to go and do a bit of fencing. Well, fence deconstruction rather than fence construction. Um, so it's not going to go in with the machines because it's a bit too wet. But we're going to um, go and Take all the staples out, roll all the wire up, and then in the springtime when it gets a bit drier, we will um, we'll sort we'll sort out getting all the posts out with the machine. So I was just uh, wondering what M's doing there. Let's have a look. Oh, I should just pack it JCB up. That's all right. Come, we've got an apprentice, and you're pushing barrow, Andy. Oh, <laughs> you 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 push it on concrete, and M can push it in field. Yeah, you do have to do a wheelbarrow exam, yeah. Well, yeah. Of course you do want billing sites. Like, this is good practice for you, this M. So you got, you got. A, can you do a circle? Go on then. Oh, you'd have to be quicker for building sites, I think, M. Bloody hell. Huh? Well, we'll have to find a bit in a minute where you'll have to take it up a plank or something. All right. You've got to stop on track. No, you're not past your test. <laughs> yeah, I'm taking piss. <laughs> so this fence here is well past its best. So we're gonna take it down, wrap all the uh, wire up, and then take the post out when it's when it's dry and we can get the machine in without making a mess. That's the plan. Did that on your own, aren't you? Go on, Andy's doing a bit of bashing and banging. Don't tell Mick Jow. Well, not be impressed, Andy. <laughs> and we got his little islands in background. Nice. Mick and Ash. Mick and Ash. Is that what we're going to call them? Yeah. Mick and Ash. Mick and Ash. Uh, why don't we are all doing it, honestly. Look, I've got my tools as well. I'm just a cameraman. That's why it doesn't look like I'm doing much. In that rate, right, Em? What? I am doing something, aren't I? Yeah, yeah. A little bit. A little bit. bit. Oh, We've got one tied up. We've learnt a bit about trees, haven't we, Em? We have, yeah. We've learnt the difference between 
fencing and what oh, other one? Edging. Oh yeah, we don't do fencing with sticks. <laughs> That's on his TikTok. You'll see that over there. Um, so yeah, still got at least three bands. To, uh, three bands. I'm talking about band because I've got band art. Um, three three lines of barbed wire. And he's just taking off another line there. And we'll roll some more up. I don't know if we're doing it most efficient way. Because we don't do this every day. We're just farmers, aren't we, Em? We're not fencers. Me and Em just rolling up that barbed wire. Love this time-lapse feature. Got Andy there. He's, he was just taking the staples out at next run. So then we could roll it back up again. So we've got it all taken off. We'll get the posts out in the spring wrapped up Andy says every other farm he would have worked on they wouldn't have saved the barbed wire Is that right? Yeah. How did you say they'd do it? Rip it out, part it up and burn it Well then what do you do with all the barbed wire that's left? Stuck it in the skip Jeez, it'd be everywhere wouldn't it Em? Um? Yeah. We've done Em, we've saved environment and uh, next time we need a bit of barbed wire for a little fencing job we've got enough for the next 25 years uh, um, yeah that's our morning I think it's time for a bit of uh, dinner I'm starving so we'll get that sorted now I've had my dinner now and it looks like one of our friends from the cow guild fraternity is here to help us fix this much better um, they're just some farmers that are down the road and we've been friends with them forever and uh, Jim who works for him is exceptional with a welder so he's going to do the welding for us on this uh, on this muck spreader wall these cogs on but he's just wanting to make sure they're in the right place Isn't that right Jim? Well, you wanting to make sure these are in the right place? Hopefully <laughs> They're not <laughs> The what? They're not? No, they're not. <laughs> oh bloody hell This, this one that's not Where's that young bird you were messing about with? <laughs> eh? <laughs> that one looks good, Jim. That one looks good. That one looks good. What one does Oh shit, why is it touching? <laughs> <laughs> Put it down to the shed and we're going to cut that cog off because Jim's only tacked it. And then tack it back up and then he can take it back to his spot and weld it up with a MIG and make it nice and proper. So we shouldn't have any problems then after that. Fish bash bosh! More power. Take two. Take three actually. Only third time lucky, eh Jim? Oh, okay. Tiki Loaded it van, get it welded up, right. and we'll get back in back in action. See you later. Yeah. Oh. Bye. We are off to go and get the rest of that fencing done. Um, looks like we've got the two Highland cattle here helping us out. Uh, yeah, I've only got about another half an hour to do here. Last few bits on post. And then all the barbed wire is gone, which is nice. And here he is, look. Hello, lad. How we doing? Hey. How we doing? <laughs> he's off. Lovely little thing, aren't you? As are you. Do you like it, Em? Fencing tool, that. Quite impressive. <laughs> makes oh. job a bit easier. It's still not easy, but it makes it a bit easier. Don't get stuck in mud, Em. Don't get stuck in mud. 
Mookie, you doing? Attitude. Getting some fencing practice in here. Honest. You sure? Honest. You nearly missed then. <laughs> so it's getting about the time that we should be feeding up. A little bit early today, but um, yeah, it's just one of them days, I suppose. Isn't really, that much happening. That's why we've got that fence done. Um, so we might even end up finishing a little bit early. Should be nice. I'll just get this bucket on. Hopefully Emma will be available to put the pipes on for me. Em, you pop his pipes on. Look at that, maximum laziness. How are you getting on with that, getting that wire off that post? You've done it? All oh, right. Is it still tangled around it a bit? Yeah. Uh, em's been practicing uh, her fencing skills by getting all these, this tangled wire. It's fairly tangled, isn't it? Yeah. Has it been fun? Yeah. yeah? <laughs> but it has. Em's got that sorted now. We're just having a little go and feeding up. So we'll see. Um, probably get finished a little bit early today, really. It's getting rough this yard. Some of the concrete we put down, uh, it's going to be over 15 years ago now. Um, money were a bit tight, and we just used to put it a little bit down at a time when odd concrete lorry were coming past with a bit extra on and of course it's not been put down right and it's now breaking up uh, just getting a bit of feeding up done and then we're nearly done uh, got a bit of deal left to do uh, it's been a bit of a steady day really getting that fence down um, what else have we done, Em? Not We're, a lot. Not a lot, really. Just took a fence down. Um, fed up. Fed up, haven't we? Yeah. Not particularly exciting happened today, but it's been nice to be outside for a change, isn't it? And not be raining. So, so, yeah, just getting the last few buckets. Oh, a bit too much pressure on my blade there. We're steering them. I don't think we front wheels are on floor. Well, it's uh, it's not very easy. I'm driving with my elbow on joystick. Um, or swapping my hands from steering wheel to joystick and holding phone. I have to get a gimbal or something, man. I need something. I need something. So I think we'll end the video today while it's still light. Um, so what we gotta tell people? You got to follow us, like us, yeah. subscribe, subscribe, hit that subscribe button, and comment, and comment, it's pretty hit the comments. We love them. We love the comments. Do it. We do it. So great, great. To, thanks, everyone. Thanks for watching, everyone. If I get my words out properly, thanks for watching, yeah. and we will see you tomorrow. Oh, I just forgot to add business. business.